Hi, my name is Hope Kaya of Santa Fe Dash webdesign.com. This is a tutorial on using your Bluehost cPanel. So if you're hosted with Bluehost.com and probably other servers that use the same cPanel um, or other hosting companies, uh, they have their own FTP client installed. Uh, in this case, unlimited FTP. And I'm teaching you here how to use that to upload files to your server. Um, in particular, I'm recording this for people who are working in Joomla, whose websites are in Joomla, and who have the JCE content editor, editor using the media manager, because you might find when you're uploading a file that you get an error message like this, no function call specified. Uh, my client had this problem, it, particularly with MP3s, uh, but it might not just be for MP3s. So I searched the web and I found, um, you know, a forum that was pretty easy. All I did was type Joomla JCE, no function call specified. And I put that in, in quotes, the no function call specified, so that I knew it would only pull up results that had that exact phrase in it. Uh, and then I got this forum uh, thread and it said basically use an FTP client instead because regarding the media manager there's a known issue with Flash version 10 and you may have Flash version 10 and that might may be why you have the problem but this would solve it. So I'm going to go back to Safari from Firefox because for some reason the FTP client it seems to work better on Safari. Um, so basically you go to bluehost.com and you log in, which I've already done here for my client. And then I've clicked on unlimited FTP, which will pull up a page that looks like this. And I'm going to fit this to our screen a little bit better. You can see on my left side are the files on my computer. And um, on the right side, you can see by the uh, IP address here, there are the files on the server. So basically, I'll be moving files from my computer to the server. And I put files on my desktop. So in, on a Mac, I would, I would locate that just by double clicking on the users and then my user folder and then the desktop, double clicking on the desktop. And uh, let's say this is the MP3 I want to upload. And then I go over to the right side, so I've clicked on that once. Uh, and I choose public underscore HTML. And in this case, we're going to images, stories, and you'll frequently see the stories folder in the Joomla site, and then the audio. And then in this case, we're going to go to Doc Talks. So I'm double clicking on that. And then I'm clicking once on the uh, MP3 I want to upload, and I'm clicking on the right-hand arrow because I want it to go up. We could download other files if we wanted, but I just want to upload a file. So this is 114 megabytes. It's going to take quite a while. Uh, so I'm not going to finish this, but I wanted to show you how it worked. And you'll see that it's going to show up on the right-hand side once it's done. So that's it. Basically, you, I'm going to cancel this transfer, and um, that's all you do. You go into your Bluehost cPanel account, and you log in if you haven't already, and you go to the FTP Unlimited, and you select the file you want to upload, and in my case, it was on my desktop. And then you click once on it. You go to the folder you want to put it in. And that's important, really important. Uh, I think it just makes life a lot easier so that you don't have to move things around later. Um, and so I'm just double clicking and drilling down, so to speak, until I get to the folder I want to upload to. And then I just click on the right hand arrow. So I'm going to cancel that again, but that's it. Pretty simple. Okay, once again, I'm Hope at SantaFe-WebDesign.com, and I hope you have a beautiful day.